Ready. Play. for me on clay. Uh, I think it's great that I managed to win. And, uh, Working? Yes. Uh, really happy with the win. It was a tough battle. First match on clay also. I needed a bit more patience also uh, during the rallies and uh, a lot of ups and downs. Uh, but overall happy with the win and looking forward for next match. Elena, congratulations. Um, in terms of preparation for the play, you say it's obviously your first match, but you got here a little bit later than some of the other players and stuff, so I'm curious how much, how comfortable do you feel right now as the play season starts? Well, uh, of course we practiced, we had uh, one week. Uh, I would say that physically I'm feeling fine. Uh, it's just a question of playing matches and just to switch your mentality and game plan to for longer rallies and uh, uh, also serves, for example, I cannot all, always uh, hit an ace and get three points, so it's just to switch the mentality and beat, uh, have patience. And the big screen and everything? Uh, no, I usually into the zone, like it's it's been always my thing and uh, sometimes I actually need opposite to look at my opponent, sometimes I'm too focused on myself, so I won't say that uh, anything around uh, distracts me. Hi Elena, you said um, that physically you're feeling great. How about mentally? Are you feeling absolute top, top confidence level or is it somewhere else at the moment? Well, of course I'm confident. Uh, I played so many matches. Uh, I mean, it's just, as I said, always on clay, you kind of want to have a bit more, but uh, I'm pretty confident in my game. And uh, uh, so, yeah. Uh, Elena, you played now against um, uh, Veronica. It was uh, number four. You, like uh, last three games, you won also. Uh, what was surprised with her game today for you? Uh, I mean, we played uh, a lot of times, and uh, it was always tough matches. So I won't say that a lot of things surprised me. It's just a matter of getting used to the clay, as I said. And here, I would say it's special course. Uh, so we both uh, were serving well and uh, these moments when it's lying or uh, things like this, of course it's not easy, but uh, I think we both played well and uh, I'm just happy that in the end uh, I could turn it around and even though I had these ups and downs, I was leading in the third set, uh, uh, lost a couple of games, but uh, managed to win. Last year, obviously, a big win in, in Rome and uh, good success on the surface. Did you feel as though that was a big boost to your confidence in, in being able to succeed on the clay and, and win big titles, whether it be you know 1000s like Rome or Roland Garros, or was it, or did you already did it not impact your belief because you already believe that you can do that? Yeah. Well, I believe I always believe that I can play good on clay, and my actual first. Uh, win uh, on the WT was on clay. It's just uh, the season is quite short and of course uh, me for example I need a bit more time to get used, to adapt, to play some matches but overall I think that uh, I can play well on all the surfaces and uh, last year uh, it was great uh, tournament in Rome and then French Open I actually feel also well there. I like the course it's just uh, I was unlucky with sickness so I think I'm Doing pretty well for now. Yesterday I watched your practice and I saw the beginning you were working a lot without the ball. You were focusing on, on your movement around the court. I was I'm wondering if this is something that you are working at the moment in the transition from the hardcore season to the clay season, or is it something that you usually do when you're at the tournament? Uh, no, of course, uh, this kind of warm ups we usually do, but uh, 
Uh, now we prefer to do it on clay course since we need to slide a lot, so to adapt a little bit, but uh, yeah, I think that's, uh, that's the main focus to slide and uh, this tournament is still, I think, uh, preparation for, for the big ones. As a follow-up to Courtney's question, I, um, I think of you as somebody who tends to prefer quicker conditions, Wimbledon champion, Australian Open finalist, etc. So when it comes to the clay, I'm thinking maybe Rome is not so much for Elena, maybe French Open not so much, and yet you won Rome. Do you have, of these sort of four tournaments with Stuttgart, and Madrid, Rome and, and Paris, is there one of the four that you think is best for you and you feel most confident on? Well, uh, it's tough to say. I like uh, a faster surface and I think in Madrid is quite fast. Uh, for now I was not successful there, but uh, I think that's a great tournament for me. I mean, Rome was, was nice and as I, as I said, French Open, I like the course. It's just uh, the question of uh, good preparation uh, and uh, yeah, be, be healthy. And then it all depends uh, on you and of course on the opening. Back to the match today, um, am I wrong saying that your inside in forehand was pretty reliable, but the regularly long line wasn't? Well, there is a lot of things uh, I can say I could have done better, but uh, I think for the first match it, it was still good and uh, uh, there is a lot to work still, some details here. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and click that notification bell so you don't miss out on all things tennis.